what is up everybody and welcome back to another episode of minecraft it has been such a long time since i did one of these but we are back and i am working here at an ocean monument um i've actually started this like a month ago and i was doing this on stream and then i got so bored of it and another thing is i made a huge mistake here i wasn't meant to have sand like that I was meant to make a cross pattern so that they could then use sponges to get rid of the water because this way it just used a lot of sand and I didn't want that. So yeah, um, a few mistakes were made so I need to clear all the sand up but one big thing is I am using Optifine. I know right? That's huge. I don't really know much about Optifine but it is good like zoom genius um i was streaming yesterday or last night actually today technically so i was streaming and i had a look at some shader packs and i'm actually quite impressed uh if we have a look at shaders here are the ones i tried uh, this one crashes uh, this one crashes and then these two are the only ones that work now i want to try the medium and light of the cylinders thing as well because from what I can see it basically changes how much haze there is and how much distortion there is to everything but this is the high it looks pretty nice um, causes quite a bit of lag while I'm recording of course and while well, I'm not recording too I'm guessing um, but yeah it looks really nice I, I like it um, it's hard to see everything though um, yeah, as you can see that's quite distorted there and I'm not a huge fan of that and uh, all of this stuff here uh, it's harder to see because of the reflection um, and then the other one the extreme is just more extreme of that as you can see more haze um, that's that's more distorted now um, okay that's a bit broken get okay, never mind I, I messed with the settings of this quite a bit. Um, but yeah, basically... I am not going to be using shaders in this world. If I was to use shaders, I'd probably try the medium and light one first of the Silders. I quite, I quite like the Silders one. Um, but yeah, I am not going to be using shaders in this world. I had a look around the world with shaders on, and I'll be honest with you, it it wasn't the same. Like, it's not the world that I know. It was completely different, and I didn't want to change that. So, this is completely vanilla Minecraft. Um, I'm going to probably run Optifine on it, because it improves my frame rate quite a bit, especially while I'm recording. Um, but yeah, let me get rid of all this, and then maybe I'll have a quick look around the world it, back at base with the shaders on, and then I'll get rid of all this water, and we'll see what we can do here. All right, so I am at base here. I just repaired all my tools and I end up spawning here because that's where I slept last. Right, so since I'm here, I decided to show you the shaders now. Uh, so this is the um, this is the Silza or whatever it is high one. I'm not gonna show the extreme. It's just more hazy and stuff. This is high, and like I'm not denying that it looks beautiful, but. This is a different world completely, like, if I was to use a shader, it would be from the start of a world, not when I'm nearly finished with it. Like, this world doesn't feel the same anymore, you know? It's a completely different game, almost. It does look beautiful, though, just saying. And also, torches. Optifine. Yay. Cool. But yeah, uh, this is that. I should probably grab some more rockets if I have any. I do, look at that. So yeah, I'm just gonna go finish up doing the digging of the sand. And then I'm actually gonna surround the whole thing in blue glass. And then I'll be good to go. I guess I'll do a bit of fly. I took most of my beacons over to there so I can have beacons there. Yeah, like... It looks beautiful. Also, I finished this. I need to get rid of the sign. Yeah, like, it looks pretty nice, I have to say. But, 
it's not for this world. Right, so I got rid of all the sand that I had placed, and now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna... So, yeah, I have this border here, and I'm gonna put blue glass here all around. Um, blue glass is very hard to see in water. Well, when there's light, of course. Oh shit, yeah. Get out of there. And this will take a lot of glass. And... Yeah, this is gonna be fun. Especially in the middle, middle area there. But yeah, I'm gonna place this all the way around, and then I'm gonna start placing in the, uh... Whatchamacallit? The sand back in, but leaving, like, a... 5x5 five five area, kind of like a grid pattern with a 5x5 five five area in which for every like grid square. And then I'm gonna get some sponges out and I'm gonna make this all disappear. Can't wait to get rid, can't wait for this to all be done and see these guys die, they're so annoying. Nice. Yeah, so that's one site done, and when we when we finish clearing this, my plan is to kind of like make a bit of a perimeter here. So I'm gonna like have this go out, or at least on the front, I'm gonna have it go out by like ten to fifteen blocks or something, and then be able to stand here because this is like where where I'm gonna have like the collection area and killing area and all that stuff. And dolphins are fun. And yeah, there's a lot of guys there. Alright, so. I need to finish doing this. I don't think I'll have enough glass, actually. Oh, right. It has been many months since I started this episode, actually. I started this early October, and it's now nearly Christmas, it's a few days to Christmas, and... Oh man, this this thing still isn't finished. But let me show you around, because I need to end this episode, damn it. Um, I am level 97, I've done so much work that I've had to repair all my tools so much. Yeah, I cleared out the entire ocean here. And then I cleared out all the water inside the temple, and then underneath the temple. And... I kept the temple a thing because I thought it'd be cool but I hollowed it out to make it easier to build but yeah anyway uh, what what I'm struggling with now is uh, Guardians be no smart um, there's low spawn rates for some reason I, I thought I lit up most of the caves around here but apparently not um, yeah low spawn rates I think I might know how to fix that but I also might not know how to fix that so yeah, that's something. Uh, technically, this water here isn't good either for it. But yeah, this is the Guardian farm so far. I'll probably have it all completed for next episode. Uh, also, 1.15 came out, so I'll be upgrading to that in the next one. Um, and yeah, this isn't working as intended. I think I might end up rebuilding this completely. They do give quite a bit of XP. Which is nice. Uh, there was supposed to be one hit killed, but um, the tutorial I was looking for all that, all at was really old, and a lot of stuff changed since then. But yeah, I'm gonna need to set up a collection system for the items and all that, and then I'm gonna need to farm them for like eight million years afterwards. But yeah. Um, that that's it for the episode I guess I don't know how long it was or anything um, also I think I showed off a um, what's it called a shader pack and I've decided that I found a much better one the Zelda's enhanced shaders they don't change lighting or give any haze they just make it look nice so this is what I would use but I'm not going to use it for this world 
like yeah it doesn't it doesn't change the lighting too much like it's not awfully dark in here but it makes everything look so much nicer apart from water because water is broken <laughs> when is water not broken in minecraft yeah i'm not going to be using shaders at all for this world while it is going and yeah this is it guys i'm wow i have spent such a long time on this you have no idea this this has taken months to do so uh yeah i guess i'm gonna end the episode here then and uh I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next one. Have a good day. Bye-bye.